Shall we begin? Let's begin now. In this video, we're going to be looking at the Float Tube Fanatics Magnetic Mount Assembly. This ingenious mounting system takes your fish finder, whether it's a Garmin or a Lowrance or a Humminbird or other popular brands, puts it on top of a battery box that clamps to single hull boats. Clamp goes over the gunnels and then it has what's called a magnetic transducer mount. That's what makes it, the whole thing work like a charm. Okay, here are the components of the system. Obviously it has the sealed 12 volt battery. This is a really good little battery. It lasts for a long long time in between charges. And next we have the mounting plate for the type of fish finder you own. This is the larger mounting plate called the U2 and it fits those fish finders with the larger base mounts and has pre-drilled holes which is pretty cool. The fish finder mounting plate that I have on my little hummingbird unit is the U1 because the mounting base on this unit just happens to be a little bit smaller. The battery case itself has an articulated mount, so if the side of your craft is curved or angled, it'll clamp right on there. Here's the heart of the system and why this works so well for your single hull craft. This is the magnetic transducer mount. It's fully adjustable. You can adjust your transducer this way or this way, this way or this way. They've got these longer transducer brackets. This might work better for your particular watercraft. Now what makes it work is there are two rare earth magnets. One on the inside of the hull and one on the outside of the hull and to take them apart, see, this, see the way this has a little groove here? You twist it because they're real strong and then you place this on the outside of your craft and this one then clamps on the inside of the craft and will hold it in place. That's it. That's all there is to it. So now having seen the various components of the system, let's mount this on a boat. Howdy fellas. Okay, we're here at Real Foot Lake, Tennessee. We're going to mount the magnetic system from fishfindermounts.com onto a single hull John boat. Hey, what do you think of this system so far? It's neat. Pretty neat, it's huh? Neat. I ain't never seen nothing like it. No, and you probably won't. I've seen a lot of them. <laughs> a lot of them. It, it is a very unique system. Now this is going to clamp right on the gunnels. All right, put that on the gunnel. Right there. Put her on there. Alright, there you go. Okay. And you'll notice this is articulated, so even though it has an angle, yeah. it'll be fine. It'll flatten out. It'll flatten out. Look at that. That works perfectly. Wow. It's isn't that sturdy. cleverly cleverly designed? Yeah, very clever. Very good. <laughs> sturdy. Very clever. Okay. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay. Now remove the battery. All right, so there's your wiring that's going to go on there. Now see this little... Yeah, that's where the wire groove? is going to go that's through, right? That's where the wire is going to go through there. So go ahead, okay. and, go ahead and hook them up onto the battery. The wire is a little black there. All right, now there's the negative. Yeah. There you go, now you're in. Perfect. Shoot you, man. Did you take shop class? Because you're pretty handy with that man, screwdriver. My father owns the body shop. All right, well, he's going to be proud of you. Okay, little John, what you got in your hand there is the actual transducer mount, right? Yeah. And these here are the magnets. This one's going to go on the inside of the hole. All right. And the other one's going to clamp on the outside. And be facing this way? And, yeah, this should be this should face forward, right? Okay. Something like that. So, yeah, that's yeah. just right. Okay, now take your other, take your inside magnet. Where is it? All right. Your other hand. Put it down to where you think it ought to be. That's it. It's got a grip. I is can feel it, it. grip already? Yeah, I can feel it moving. <laughs> I can move this and feel that moving on the outside. Okay, that's it, right? Yeah, so, that's good locked Lord. On. So the transducer is mounted. Yeah. It's in the water. Locked on. Locked on. Flat to the water. Check. 
Yeah. All right, good enough. And this just okay. Put your thumb screw back on. This is kind of fun, isn't it? Oh yeah. And now I'm going to certify you as an electrician. Okay, on the back of that unit, take those two plugs, stick them in there. Are they both in? Yes, sir. That is neat. That is really cool. Now one more thing. Yeah. You see those slots down there? Mm -hmm. Okay, and then you got all this wiring here, right? Yeah. So what we're going to do is we, we would like to secure that to the box. Like with this wire no. or zip tie? Let, my... let's, let's do... I got a zip tie on my hat. You're thinking way... <laughs> you're thinking I'm way... I'm prepared, man, buddy. I'm on your hat. No, I'm no, it prepared. comes with zip ties. <laughs> Look at here. Well, it's a little bigger. Bigger's better, yeah, ain't it? Use yours, save it. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> So okay. now, if that if that transducer ac exactly accidentally knocks off. off by one of those stumps out in the lake, guess what? It's healed. It is not going to go it's anywhere. Got it's going to be zip tied, locked, 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 locked securely to the boat. All right. Just so like what? This is your final answer. What do you think of the whole system? Well, it's an excellent system, man. I like it. Man, it's so easy to hook up. It's mounted secure. It's not really hanging over the side. A lot of them get knocked off the other boats because they're sticking out foot over. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now, if I get some fish, you got to clean them for me, okay? I'll clean them for you. I'll hook you up. <laughs> I'll hook you All right, little John. Thanks a lot. No problem, bud. Nice job. Isn't that a cool yeah, system? That's cool. Yeah, yeah, that's neat. <laughs> Fishfindermounts.com. Very, very neat. Oh, shout.